So our mission is to accelerate the development of AI applications. You know, we believe that AI and machine learning is, uh, you know, if not the most important technology of today, one of the most important technologies that's going to enable huge amount of goodness for for the world and and just enable the world to operate significantly more efficiently and effectively and enable new customer experiences. Um, and uh, our our vision in accomplishing that is building the most data centric uh, infrastructure platform for for AI and machine learning. And the the real insight that um, that we have or the thing that powers everything that we do is this thought that you know uh, data is the new code um, and that that the thing that will dictate the performance of these machine learning systems and these AI systems of the future is actually the data sets and the data that they're trained on much more so than the code um, that is written to power them. And so, you know, if we were to boil it down to a two sentence, it's that better data results in better AI. And we've taken that sort of core idea and uh, use that to build out an infrastructure platform to power uh, a large number of, uh, a large swath of the sort of like AI ecosystem or the, the sort of like AI use cases out there. So we originally started with data labeling or data annotation, which is the problem of converting sort of raw data feeds to useful label tag data that can be actually used to, to train um, large scale machine learning systems. Um, we actually started in autonomous vehicles. And then since then, we've scaled across a variety of different industries, like you mentioned, from e-commerce to financial services, to the government, to work with large tech platforms and sort of everything in between. Uh, and what we do with these customers is we help them not only with data annotation, data labeling, we help them with data management, we help them uh, build out actually algorithms. And so with some customers, we provide algorithms directly to them uh, for stuff like document automation or e-commerce AI or, uh, or in the government use cases. And so we've been able to expand pretty rapidly into a huge number of uh, product areas, into a huge number of verticals. But again, centrally at the core, it's all been powered by this concept that better data results in better AI. And the, the most valuable thing that we can do to ensure that uh, we have great AI systems of the future is to build incredible systems to be, build great data sets. So that's what we do. God, that's amazing. Uh, and, and the fact that you came across the seedling of that insight when you were 19, you weren't even 20. And uh, it, I, I'm actually curious if we just go back now, knowing what you know, Scale AI has grown to, um, when you were 19, what gave you confidence in this concept that data is a new code, that, you know, this, that was the basis, that was the soil for, you know, the growth of, you know, beautiful AI algorithms in the future. Um, and what gave you the courage to jump in and do this? Yeah. So, so it's sort of a few things. So, uh, when I was actually, I was at, um, I was at MIT, I was studying AI and machine learning, and this was, this was the year when um, Google released TensorFlow uh, and uh, and DeepMind released AlphaGo, so it was sort of this like big seminal moment um, for AI and machine learning, and it really felt you know it was this you know I actually remember there's like this reporter who who was walking around um, MIT campus and was like interviewing MIT students to see what they thought about about AlphaGo, and so it was like it was this very clear moment where it, like felt like AI, hey AI is actually um, is going to happen, it's going to be big, and then I remember. Um, both in in some in some projects as well as like um, in some school projects as well as some side projects. Um, uh, I and one of these side projects I remember very viscerally was like I want to build a camera inside my um, inside my uh, in my, inside my fridge that would tell me when my roommates were going to, were stealing my food. And um, I remember very viscerally, it's like, hey, you know, there's all these great neural networks. They're really really cool, but at, at the end of the day, the algorithm is only as good as the data. That it's trained on, and so it it was like, hey, this is a this is going to be a critical almost pillar of of whatever AI looks like in the future, and um and and I looked around and I realized like, hey, this is a big problem that that there aren't actually that many people trying to solve, or there there aren't that many people focused on solving this problem, and and ultimately the thing that gave me conviction was was frankly the I'd seen sort of the success stories. In, in sort of the years prior of, of platforms like AWS, which enabled everybody to build these large scale um, internet systems or, or, or sort of like websites and, and, and um, large scale internet platforms. Um, I've seen the success of platforms like Stripe uh, for to enable payments and enable sort of like you to build businesses on the internet. And so uh, ultimately the realization was kind of, hey, you know, what, 
AWS has done for the cloud or what Stripe has done for payments, you know, there's an opportunity for a company to do that for AI and unlock this huge amount of potential for the technology by solving one of these critical pillars. And the pattern recognition was that, hey, data centric AI was, was going to be just as important as, as some of these other sort of like foundational pillars. Um, and so that's, that's really what, what kind of got me excited at the time. And, and I, you know, honestly speaking, I didn't have all the answers. Um, I didn't know necessarily that, that this idea was, was definitely going to be, um, uh, as important as I think we believe it is now, or, or I didn't necessarily know that it was going to be, um, as, uh, as exciting as, as we think it is now, but, but the, the sort of fundamentals were there for it to be like, hey, this is certainly worth exploration.